Did you call and confirm our reservation? Yes, dear. Did you confirm through email and speak to somebody on the phone? Yes, dear. And did you request a king-size medium coil mattress? Because you know I can't sleep on a mattress that's too soft. Yes, Marcy. Did you remind Mrs. Wilson that she needs to feed Sparkles twice a day? Of course, honey. Okay, all packed up. I got their all changed, the tank full. Off to the Poconos. Put your seatbelt on, Ben. It's gonna be a nice road trip. Too bad it's only gonna be four hours. Well, if I had my way, we'd be going to the Bahamas. But Dr. Feinberg thinks a road trip will bring us closer. And another thing, Father McCarthy asked why you weren't in church again. Am I the only one bothering to do any good deeds around here? This past month alone, I volunteered at the March of Dimes, I baked cookies at the Senior Center, and I spent all last Saturday at the soup kitchen while you were playing golf with the guys. Seriously, I thought you were gonna do more to give back to the community this year. Am I the only one who enjoys selfless pursuits? I give back. Oh, you do? Yeah, I do nice things all the time, things that you don't know about. I like helping people. Oh, really? Yeah, I can help people just as much as you do. I'd like to see you try. I will, first chance I get. Okay, Ben, you do that. Yeah, okay, here we go. I'm gonna do a good deed right now. Oh, real nice, Ben. Oh, uh, uh car, car trouble? Yeah, my motor's blown and I don't get service out here. Well, do, do you need a ride somewhere? Uh, yeah, are you guys headed towards Bethlehem? Oh yeah, no problem, get in, we'll give you a ride. Oh, thank you. I'm uh, Ben and this is, uh, uh, Marcy? Oh, oh yeah, Marcy. Oh, um, Jizzle! Thank God you guys pick me up. I got no cell service. I'm Candy, by the way. Uh, so where are you headed? I'm headed to Bethlehem to meet up with my bestie. Oh my God, I have the best road trip CD ever. Oh, that's really great. Oh, good idea, Darcy. We don't want Benji to get distracted while we're driving and hit a fuzzy wuzzy woodchuck. Oh, hey, that reminds me. I didn't introduce you to my pet. This is Detective Steve Nash. Have you committed any crimes? <laughs> okay, uh, let, let's go. Road trip time, Benji, Darcy, and Connor. It's Marcy. Detective Steve thinks Darcy. So, Candy, uh, what do you do for a living? Oh, I'm an actress. Oh, nice, really? Uh, what have you been in? Let me show you. I have it right here on my phone. I did this indie crime drama called Busted. Check it out. See Sheriff Bedoin from the Bethlehem Sheriff Department about to bust into a prostitution ring. Come on, check it out. Oh no! Busted again. Yeah, I knew it. Throw the cuffs on. You know what to do. That's terrific. I think I've seen enough. Oh, do you really think it was? Did you really think I was a prostitute? Yeah. I sure did. Ugh, nailed it. Oh. You guys into like yoga or something? <laughs> oh, oops. Oh, don't worry. It won't smell. It didn't come from my butt. Uh, so, uh, Bethlehem, that, that sounds lovely. Oh, uh, well, yeah, it's gonna be. I got all my stuff. I've got my bikini. I've got my tampons. I got lots and lots and lots of makeup. And I've got my tongs, you know, in case the boys get fresh. Or, I don't know, you wanna eat some salad or something? Benji, I got a tinkle. Now, you can't hold it? 
I am holding it. And the seats are leather. They won't even absorb anything. Okay, okay, I'll pull over. I'm gonna take the check to Steve in case he has to be. I can't believe you picked up this little amateur porn star nutcase. I, I assume there's a loony bin in Bethlehem? You've really done it this time, Benjamin. This trip was supposed to bring us closer. Wait until Dr. Feinberg hears about this. I know, I know, I'm sorry. That was a woodchuck, right? Yup. Ben, honey, maybe good deeds are a little overrated. Yeah, I agree. <laughs>